Hello guys, welcome back to Lajipong Wash TV. If you're coming across the channel for the very first time, speaking as a boy Lajipong, the king of boys of the entire Africa, the update I have for you today is regarding the um, traditional wedding of Deborah Paul Eneshi, the daughter of Paul Eneshi, the traditional wedding that was conducted yesterday. <laughs> You know, some things where um, a lot of people did not notice some things in course of the traditional wedding yesterday. So that is what I want to open your eyes to in course of this video. You know, a lot of people have come across the video of the traditional wedding, but I just want to open your eyes to something that really happened um, in course of the occasion yesterday. But I get to that, you need to know this. According to some source, there are that Deborah soon to be grown in San Peluco, the CEO of Auto Media and a real estate investor in Abuja. So that is who Deborah Polenesha is getting married to. The person, um, the guy name is um, Sam Peluco. So he's a the guy is into media and a, you know a photographer, and, you know a real estate investor in Abuja. His studio was recently unveiled and prayed over by Pastor Paul Enesche and his wife Becky. He, he is already a son to Pastor Paul Enesche because they already took him as a son. He is well loved by the family and he is a successful young man and a very good photographer. You know, I said that earlier. He does videography at the top level and is one of the most sort of um, multimedia consultants in Abuja. Someone is also a member of the media department at the Glory Dome. Headquarter of Dynamis is 27 years old and is only a few months older than um, Debbie Eneshe. Just um, a few months. They are of the same age. They are, um, they are both 27, 27 years. But um, Samuel it was just a few months older than um, Deborah. He's from Igede Benue but likes to identify with the Idoma which is his spiritual father and soon to be father in lost tribe. Samuel has attended the Dynamic School of Ministry and is a graduate of mass communication of the Benue State University in Benue State. It was further gathered that Samuel proposed earlier this year why both families met last month and the introduction of both couples. Sam Oloko and Bede Mrs. The Pastor Paul weeks ago wrote, Thank you for giving all of yourself and your family to the work of God that we have benefited so greatly from. That has made us better human on earth. What can I express how much we value you and how grateful to God we are for your impact on this generation? Thank you and thank you and thank you. We pray that the hand of the Lord continue to be with you and your most precious family. Welcome to a greater level of grace and impact, Daddy. From our CEO, Sam Houghton Uloko, and the entire Houghton group, we love you with everything in us. So, that was the better message that Sam Uloko, the um, husband to be of Deborah Paul Energy, sent to um, Paul Energy during his birthday week, or let me say during his birthday. He said, Happy birthday, Sam. So Deborah Enenche and Sam Loko big wedding will be holding today. So they, they had a traditional wedding yesterday. So the main wedding will be holding today in Glory Dome, Abuja. You know, it will be recorded that um, Deborah is an upcoming gospel singer, yeah. And the first daughter of Pastor Paul Enenche of Dynamics International Gospel Center. So they will be doing the normal main wedding to, today in um, Glory Dome that is the dynamics worship center so what do you guys observe in course of this video i'll be showing to you for some couples of time now so um the main thing that really happened in course of the video is you should look at this very well when paul energy gave um deborah energy the wine to go and give to the person that um she wish um she loved the person that she really wants to get married to the person that she wants to get married you understand mm -hmm. so um the girl really moved around you understand she was looking and sorting for um sam but he couldn't find sam Oloko because i don't know the reason why they went to hide the guy in one corner 
the girls like kind of frustrated him because he couldn't find the guy. I, I don't know that it's some normal wedding, like the girl would just they should if the father of the girl should give her wine to give to the husband that she's intended to marry. The, um the girl will see the husband as soon as possible, very fast, no hidden things there. But they hide this guy and a lot of people even cover him up. So the girl looked from north to south, from east to west. He couldn't find Sam. That was what happened. But it was even she was even kind of frustrated before she finally finds her. And when she gave Sam the drink, she said something. She said, "Come and see my father." And if you look at the very way, you see that the moment Sam got to uh, where Paul and she is, because the brother have to take him down to where um, the father is, which is Paul and she. So uh, when Sam got to where Paul and she was seated immediately he prostrated and he prayed for him so i would like you guys to drop your opinion regarding um this video just drop your opinion feel free to drop your opinion what do you, what do you guys think regarding the video drop your opinion speaking as well like pork and going to just get another minute for you on life or watch tv regarding the wedding of deborah paul and and sam oloko guess what see my next video Look at this one now, and, and my eye is turning red. Yeah. Oh. But we thank God it's normal. Yeah. She's with this and released in the table. Hey. So now, after this, traditionally, she's here in our presence. You are supposed to come. You will back call it, you know, thank you. Hey. I think, not that I think, like, we are going to take that one outside. Yeah. Then we will repeat this one again. Yeah. This one again, we will repeat it outside. Yeah. That people will go at their witness. So that this is the end of the traditional marriage. Yeah. Yeah. In our place now, the next is that she would have retired back to her mother's room. Then after four bit hour, yeah. that is 70,000 naira. Yeah. That would not be all right. That 70,000 naira is supposed to buy goat meat. You <laughs> 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 Let's go. One, two.